Yeah, we work uh, on the we work on the on the points that you think are important for the team. We got some good friendly matches. We gave also enough uh, match time for everyone to be ready. We play always with two teams, get them play 90 minutes to for the physical point also to be ready on Sunday. And then having all the players now without quarantine, having them together, so we we just prepare for for having many games now in a row. And we hope that we will be ready for all that games. Yeah, the target is clear. It's the same. We we believe in ourselves. We, th we think we have a, a very strong squad, and the target is to to go game by game. But of course, always to go for three points. Yeah, he's a he's a phenomenal player. I always say that. Uh, he can make the difference. He's a player that uh, needs to be free. He's a typical number 10 that moves very good off the ball, has a very good eye for, for the final pass, for the key pass. And, uh, and we are giving him that freedom, of course, with some defensive responsibilities. But uh, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm happy to have a player like him in the team. He was the last one to, yeah. to arrive. Né? He needs some, some time to, to know the players. But now with all these four weeks, yes. I think he's already totally integrated. We are trying to, to find the best uh, uh, possible runs yeah. for him or the best position, how we can play with him and the other Brazilians in front. But uh, yeah, as I said, we, we had a good time to work and uh, I believe we are ready. Yeah, normally football without fans is not so funny. Yeah, we we would love to have the fans, not no. only in our home, but also in the opponent's house. But we have to understand the situation in the world and we have to respect that because uh, the health of the players and, and also the health of the people that would join uh, is always uh, the priority. So we hope that this will, will finish soon, yes. but so long this uh, the security come first, okay, we have to play without fans.